Well, I guess you could say this is an experiment of sorts. It's mostly just me feeling like crap, but not knowing how to express it. So this is a Sharpie, in case you haven't noticed. And I'm going to go through and point out every fucking imperfection that I see and that I feel is holding me back from loving myself. First, let's start with the face. Yes, this is, I don't even know. You could call it an art project to make you feel like it's doing something. But really, it's just me being a little shit with a Sharpie. So yeah, all right. First of all, it's a really big forehead. Like, you could totally take away this part and still have a nice, normal forehead. Like, why you gotta be so big? It's more like a five head. It's not even a four head. It's a five head. That is probably backwards. Second, this little shit of a pimple spot right here. Right here. Look at all those. Look at them. They're like, it's like, hey, you want some pimples? Yeah, just, just go right in the one concentrated area. Just that one. Second is like my like doublish chin thing kind of over here. It's like, I mean, just kind of when I'm talking and I'm looking at pictures of myself, and I'm like, oh shit, where the fuck is that coming from? What the fuck? Okay, um, I wish I had some like defined, like, jawline. I kind of really want that. It would make me feel better about my nose. That's what all the models have these days, right? Hey. Alright. Yes, I have boobs. I am a goddamn S-L-U-T slut. I'm a slut. I'm a slut because I have boobs. Alright. These shoulders are way too broad. I can't fucking do this backwards. B R O whatever the fuck. Shoulders are way too broad. I can't wear any dress with these goddamn shoulders. These fucking stretch marks. I'm fucking done with these little shits. Like, so tie I'm a tiger. These are my stripes. No, I'm fucking, fucking, fucking gross and disgusting and revolting. <sighs> My arms are too fat when I look at them in pictures. These so fat with these fat little fuckers. These fat, 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 fat and disgusting and revolting. My thighs are too big and my calves are like cankles and I just can't fucking deal with this shit anymore. You know, some days. I really wish I had a knife or some kind of surgical instrument and just take all my extra fat and take all my fat and just cut it. Just cut it all off. I just want to see this. I just want to cut that off. Just go snip, 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 and then it's gone. So are my insides, but I forgot to give a shit. I just, if I draw the perfect body on myself, you think people would love me? Maybe if I draw on some better eyebrows, make my eyebrow game stronger. Would people love me then? If I made my nose just a little bit smaller. Would I be lovable? Would I be attractive? Would I be worth it? If I stop being such a goddamn slut? Would people care? I don't know. And some days I feel like I'll never know. Because this is my body. No matter how hard I try to love it. I'm terrified I'm going to be stuck in this forever. I see all these pretty girls with these beautiful flat stomachs. Thigh gaps kind of keep me out. But beautiful flat stomachs and like tiny shoulders and tiny wrists. And just beautiful and delicate. And I wonder how that... They're beautiful in their own way, but so are others. And I just wonder, when did I learn the best part about me was negative space? The stuff that isn't there. The double chin that isn't there. The stomach that isn't there. The thighs that aren't there. 
When did I learn the best part of me is the part that disappears? When did I... When did I decide not to love myself? Because there was so much of me. When did that start to define me?